everyone! Welcome back to another episode of Boredom Breakers! I know that when I posted um, that ice cream video, I told you that the next video would come today or tomorrow. I made it the same day, but I didn't post it the same day, so sorry about that. Today, it, we are going to do a fun little craft that is a boredom breaker and is a great present for your parents. You're probably wondering what it is, or you probably saw the title, and yeah. Okay. Today we're going to make gratitude jars. You probably don't know what that is, but the, my sister today, or not today, on my birthday last year, she gave me a little book of Ways to be Thankful by National Geographic, and one of the things that you can do is make a gratitude jar. So, I made one, but I'm going to make one for my mom. This is the example. So, basically, I'll go like this. But this is gratitude jar. It's a little label with some of my finest tapes. Yeah, not too bad, though. So if you're feeling sad, just, you could take a slip. And this little slip says, it's backwards for you, but it does inspire everyone. And I think that's a pretty positive message. So the supplies you will need for this craft is scissors. Not the safest way to use them. A pen, my funnest little fuzzy pen. A piece of lined or blank paper. I have lines. And a book that you can find positive messages if if you have it. If you don't have one of those, you, you can just make up your own. So I have this little book called Stressless, which has a whole bunch of inspiring things in it. Let's get started. First, you want to cut your paper. You want to cut off the... Um, you, so you know how in paper... You have that lined bit, and then you have this this line, the faded red line. You want to cut the holes and that line off so you don't see them. Good. I got my strip with the holes off, and now I just have paper. Now you just want to cut it into strips. What I do, personally, is I just cut one strip at a time. So just make them, like, take your thumb and make it, like, the size of your the this your knuckle part to the nail and just make it like about that wide you can do it bigger or smaller whatever fits you but that i feel that that is a good size for me oh by the way um i recently actually sprained my ankles so that's why i'm not standing because you know in a lot of my videos i am but i have i have sprained my ankles so i have bandages and everything it's not the funnest time right now, but they're getting better. So now, since you have that strip, you, you want to cut a, a bit so you have a little piece. Now, we're I'm going to pick a strip from this from my already done gratitude jar and put it on here. Okay. Snuggle up with a blanket. Don't know what I was thinking. Okay, let's write that down. You can write whatever you want. I'm just going to give you a few examples. Oh, another thing you need is a jar. I don't have that. Oh, shoot. I'll just use this handy little mug for now. Oh, you also want to fold it so you don't see the message. You get it. I just want to tell you guys something that you'll probably learn with the internet. It's really weird. But, okay, so I've been kind of browsing on YouTube and I've just want i just want to know like what's po popular videos what have gotten like a million likes guess what there's this i'm not saying it's bad or anything that what they did but they did um they have a channel called hamster kitchen so they make a whole bunch of mini food for their hamster that is over a million likes something you'll find on the internet is the weirdest things get the most likes anyway oh my goodness I got one that's really long and won't fit on this paper, but I'll tell you it anyway. When sitting, just sit. When walking, just walk. Above all, do not wobble. Traditional Zen saying. Some people, this may not be your cup of tea, but I, I like it. So, <laughs> I found one that I really like too. Be kind, everyone. Let's put that on there. Be kind. Perfect. And yeah, 
yeah, you just have to do a whole bunch more of those. So I'm just going to make a whole bunch more slips. I'm back. So I just finished getting my gratitude jar ready. I have a few slips in here and I decided that I'll, I'll make one new for my mom every day. I'll make a new one for my mom every day. But that's how you make a gratitude jar. It's quite simple and I really like it. And you can always make a snazzy little um, label for your gratitude jar. Oh, you can also make an activity jar, which is basically you have the slips and you do everything the same but you write down like do 10 jumping jacks or give a tree a hug i don't know unless you're a tree hugger but yeah that's basically it and i'm just gonna go get my mom and let's see how she reacts to the gratitude jar so you know how if parents like it i'm gonna go get her right now be right back now my mom is here, and let's give her the gratitude jar. Thank you. So what am I doing here? So you just pick a slip each day or whenever you want it. And I decided since I didn't get to um, fill it all, that you get I'll make one new slip per day. Okay. So do I get to read it? Yeah. Okay. Okay, Koa, let's read this together. Be be the light. Oh, that's so oh, beautiful. Oh, he's just going to eat it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. Be the light. That's so nice. Thank you. You're welcome. Bye. Okay, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this video. And there will be more boredom breaker, boredom breaker videos coming soon. Please remember to like this video and subscribe to this video and you probably all know this but you know some people don't I didn't know it but you can just like you know how if you're watching one of my videos or any video actually there's a little icon of what it's called so say there's a YouTube channel called cooking with Emma I don't know it'll have a little icon that maybe has Emma's picture you can click on it and it'll show all of the cooking with Emma videos you can do that to my videos as well. You can click on the little Boredom Breakers icon and it'll show you all four of my videos, including this one. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Bye.